Sorry, you're on now. Yeah. Okay, shall I say it again? Yes, sure, please. Yeah. Okay, I was just uh, uh, saying that uh, in 1964, I was in uh, India. I had no Christian background, and uh, I was uh, staying uh, in a, uh, a house in New Delhi, and. Um, uh, some uh, uh, folks have been sharing the good news with me, but I really didn't understand it. Um, but I always remember it was February the 22nd, and I could even take you to the place uh, where this happened, because uh, it was such a vivid experience. But what led up to it that night, I was sitting down uh, reading the little uh, booklets about uh, that gave Buck Singh's testimony and it was called Joy Unspeakable and Full of Glory and I read that and it was just uh, uh, almost immediately after that that I fell on my knees and just uh, asked Jesus to uh, come into my life and uh, I was just transformed uh, from that uh, moment onwards. And so... <laughs> Hallelujah! <laughs> it is such an amazing thing. And I'm so glad. I think the Lord brought me here today to listen to this testimony, take it and listen and send it to at least 200 people who will be encouraged by this. Really. Yeah, this goes out on my WhatsApp today. I can, to I can re remember it so vividly. So vividly. Yeah, yeah. Just, how God yeah. raises up prophets for the age and Buxin was a prophet for the age. Yeah, yeah. Do you have a prophet for this age? Uh, and I can only remember. It was, um, of course, anybody who's an authoritarian is really the West. I just read a book by Africa. It was about this big. Yes, yeah, that's true. Yeah. You know, uh, yeah. Yeah. And I'm not saying I agree with you some know, so, you know, on the outside, mm -hmm. uh, joy unspeakable and full of glory, mm -hmm. and then on the inside, the pages, you know, about the story, you know, finding the Lord and the wonderful, wonderful testimony. Praise God. Yeah. So happy. Thank you.